Today I'm going to sharpen my uh, grass trimmer. This is one with a really long handle. <laughs> the older you get, I, the older I get, the more I like it because <laughs> I don't have to kneel down to trim. And I also have a uh, hand one that you need to bend down to trim. So let's get started here. First off, I'm going to take a wet rag, carefully clean off this blade, that junk that's on there. This one's really dirty. This one, well, that's dark color. It's probably as dirty. It just doesn't show up as much. Not as much contrast. I'm gonna let that soak a little bit and then uh, clean that off. And I'm gonna do the same. Clean this up too. I've got those cleaned off and they're pretty decent. On this long handled one, I'm going to actually take this blade off. There's just three screws here that uh, make it pretty easy to do. The other hand clipper, I can't take that one apart very easily. It looks like it's actually riveted together. So I'm just going to remove these screws. And then this whole silver blade will come right off. It'll make it easier to sharpen it. If this was really bad shape, I would use a, a, a file, hand file, but that removes a lot of steel in a hurry. So what I'm going to do is use one of the stones from this, uh, the Triangle Sharp Maker by Spyderco. Great, great tool. I'll put a link in the description below where you can pick one up. So then I'm going to, let's see here, I have to do it left-handed. Determine the angle that the bevel is sharpened this way. And just move the stone along just sharpening that, that very edge that goes to a point. This edge, this side is straight, so I just want to just clean up any possible burrs on that cutting edge. That should be good. And then I'll do the same thing with this blade. And also do the same thing with these blades. Well, I shall show you how to do that one actually do that right now whoops and this one okay the angle is this way kind of weird doing this left-handed but it's doable tip and I want to get back this way as far as I can go too. And then just clean off any possible burrs in this. I'm keeping the stone pretty much almost flat with the blade. And then I'll do this bait blade too. And I've got those sharpened, put this blade back on. This one's all sharpened up and uh, let's go see how they cut. Let's see how this cuts. Oh, really nice. That trims down really quick. And now we'll check the other one. 
Oh yeah. Looks oh, great. Be sure and check out my other videos. Please subscribe, like, share, leave a comment below. Have a great day.